Hello, my name is Scott Travers. I'm the president of the Society of Energy Professionals. Welcome and thank you for joining us for this video. As you know, we're bringing six constitutional questions to you through a referendum. This is a short video to explain one of the six packages. So this package deals with improving the financial management of the society. So it's a very simple package. It's the simplest of the six. And the intent of this package is to do some cleanup. Currently, the Constitution actually specifies that some of our money needs to be held in financial vehicles which no longer exist. So we need to clean up the Constitution and modernize it. At the same time, this is an opportunity for the leadership to improve our procedures and allow for a better management of the resources of the union. So what this procedure does is open up the opportunity to invest our money in better vehicles that provide uh, higher rates of return. So for example, uh, the current process defines that the society has to keep six months of our operating budget in a reserve fund. And that's a very good practice, it's very prudent, and that practice will continue after these changes. But the current procedure defines that that money has to be kept in a simple checking account, earning essentially no interest. What the procedure will do is outline the money be held in an appropriate fund that allows us to get the money if we need it in an emergency, but earns a better return on investment. So for example, it allows us the ability to put the money in treasury bills rather than in a simple checking account. So if you click on the link on the website, it will take you to the specific constitutional language associated with this change and lay it out for you in a table. So what you see in front of you is the change for this section for the Constitution. This is a very simple change. So what you see in front of you is that in section 13.5.2 of the Constitution, it currently says it may not invest society reserve funds nor the society training account in securities other than those authorized by law for the investment of trust funds and in credit unions. That is now being revised to say it may not invest society funds in securities other than those authorized by the investment procedures. And those investment procedures are authorized by the board of directors and taken to society council um, and they outline the appropriate vehicles for the society assets. So that's where the information can be found. It's really important. I'd like to remind you that the voting window is from February 21st to March 7th, and I encourage you to add your voice to the process, and please make sure you vote. It'll only take a moment, uh, and if you have any problems with the voting process, please don't hesitate to talk to your local elected representative or call us here at the society office. Someone will be happy to walk you through the process and make sure you get through the vo voting process smoothly. So again, the window is February 21st to March 7th. Please make sure you vote, and thank you very much for joining us.